Welcome into Extra Time on a very special day. It's our producer Pete's birthday. Oh, oh yes. Is, that, now, is anybody actually noisy? It's all going to be over guessing. I don't know, actually. This isn't quite fun for people who's watching, yeah, guessing the right. age of someone they've never met. Uh, yeah, we don't want to meet them. That's oh, it. Yeah. <laughs> we don't want to meet them. Right. Apparently, you know, it was a good chance if you you see a guy, somebody walking down the street with bandages around him, hobbling along with like, a, boot. a boot on his yeah, foot. Yeah, because he's lumping. He, has he, a, he had a cane once. He had a cane. Yeah. Ask him for sympathy. He has a, a reputation as being a bit of a hypochondriac. He's 44. What? 44, <laughs> apparently. He, my God. He, he's 44. He must have had some life when he was young. <laughs> what did they have him doing? <laughs> Carrying bags of coal around when he was four. <laughs> OK, right. Yeah, that was a tough <laughs> upbringing. I'll tell you what, I feel better now. <laughs> uh, let's go to the crux of it. Uh, Craig obviously said that Juve were going to go through yesterday. Uh, you guys got listened to Craig Moore, knew that Ronaldo was going to dominate against Atleti. Well, I agree, I agree. listen to him more, you haven't lot. He's a psychic. You, you're the man, Mr. Oh, Burley. yes, he's the man. Uh, and the next one continues. Oh, he, meant, he, meant, he meant psycho. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he didn't mean psychic. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> true. Uh, uh, how hard is it going to be to get Dan's foot out of his mouth after he predicted that this match was going to be so boring? It wasn't boring, was it? Juve were good. How um, do Madrid feel about Ronaldo right now? Zidane must be like, I told you so. Who's Zidane talking to? Hmm? Who's Zidane talking to? Perez, maybe? Oh, my God. Just ask you a question. I, don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought you might know. What did he say? He said, what did he say? I'm going to be leaving, but I'm going to give you a bit of advice. Keep one of the best players in the world. <laughs> yes. He knows his stuff, doesn't he? Yeah, yeah, I mean, out there. Yeah. Where does tonight's Champions League performance for Ronaldo rank in his career, Gab? Wow, well, he had a bunch. I mean, I remember, I think it was his second or third year, uh, they played Bayern in the uh, quarterfinal, I want to say. They won 2-1, um, and then it went to penalties. Uh, he was outstanding that night. Uh, you also obviously remember, more recently, at the World Cup, the opening game against uh, against uh, Spain was that dramatic uh, free kick. Possibly the oh the Wolfsburg game. You, you know what? I was thinking about this before. I'm like, where have I seen this before? Uh, the Wolfsburg quarterfinals, Champions League 2015-16. Uh, Zidane's first season in charge, or first half season in charge. They lose the first leg two 0 They're home at the Bernabeu. I think he scored two goals in the space of like two minutes or something. And then he scored a free kick to win it from time. So, you know, he had three goals that night and uh, came back from 2-0 down the first leg. Easy peasy. Done this how about, before. How about the reason as to why he's in Juventus? The bicycle kick goal against Juventus. Yep. In Juventus, Interim. where the fans essentially said, OK, well, we give up. Either we bring him or we're not going to win. Stevie, what are your thoughts on Ronaldo doing Simeone's celebration? Did he? Yes, he did. The, 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 yes, uh, yes. The, uh, <laughs> what did he say? <laughs> what? What? What is that? <laughs> What's up? Uh, what did you make of it? I don't mind it, you know. No? No. Listen, if somebody does something Damn. and basically is doing it to you and the rest of your teammates, yeah. and it goes wrong in the second game, I think you've got every right to Rub do exactly the same thing. Yes. Gav? Now, do you know who else feels that way, Stevie? Is Simeone himself. He was asked about it after the game, and uh, he basically said he had every right to do it. He showed, you know, he has them too. He showed that he has more, he had more of them tonight. And uh, he's got the right attitude and professionalism, and, and I respect that. So. Simeone is not bothered. I'm not sure anybody else should be. HR at the door. Maybe they're bothered. So let's move on <laughs> quickly, shall we? Uh, is they're coming after Stevie. <laughs> <laughs> it's Cristiano, the best Champions League player of all time. No idea. Hmm. I, I, can't, I just can't remember. Top goal scorer. Uh huh. Put it this way. Let's make it easier. Is there anybody ahead of him in any category? No. What? Does your trophies won. Goal yeah. scored. Like Messi's won four, he's won five. Uh -huh. Right. He's, won, he's scored more goals than Messi. Uh -huh. So that would be a yes. Yeah. Has to be. I think so. Yeah. yeah. I know. Sure. Yeah. Perfect. Should Griezmann have gone to Barca in the summer, Ali? Uh, 
<laughs> well, he wishes he had. He was anonymous. Today. No, and that, and, and see, and that's part of the problem, is that there are moments in which you need to be the guy. And when they were under pressure, and there were moments in which maybe you get an opportunity to get the team forward because you can hold on to the ball, there was no participation from Griezmann whatsoever today. Now, Atletico Madrid didn't play well at all, but he didn't even play. Yeah. He wasn't even out there. And Morata's renaissance is over. Huh? <laughs> Well, he did, start, he did get Juventus off to a flying start yeah. with a little giveaway. Uh, giveaway, which sent, I think it was Bernadeschi away, mm -hmm. and then just scored from the cross. So, yeah. Is it disrespectful for City to score seven goals when they didn't even need to score one to make it through to the next round? Are you kidding me? No. Are you kidding me? It's disrespectful to take the mickey out of the opposition. Correct. Listen, if I'm, if I'm playing for Schalke, I'd rather get beat 10-0 than 1-0 and have them show Bolton for for 60 or 70 minutes. So, absolutely not. Why you try and beat them 1-0 and then leave yourself open to maybe them getting a couple on the yep. on the counter out of nothing? Professional sports. This is not under 11. Or they didn't, probably needed a bit more than that with the away goal. Yeah. This is not juice boxes and orange slices. No. This is professional. It is. That's it. Just like this show. Which well, we'll be back. tomorrow. <laughs> this is more juice boxes uh, than we'll orange slices. We'll be looking slices. back at <laughs> Bayern against Liverpool, plus of course Ooh, Barca against Lyon. Uh, are you here tomorrow? I am. Is he watching the I game? Am not. The question no. is, is yeah. he watching the, watching the game in the green room with us, or is he watching it? It depends. At his own desk. It depends. Oh. And why does it depend on, Stevie? Well, I might start the game with you, but I might sneak off. Oh. All right. <laughs>